Let's bring in Cecilia Vega now. And Cecilia, we've seen the pictures of Hillary Clinton looking really happy right after the debate. It, is her team as happy as she was with her debate performance? Oh, Michael, definitely. They are calling this her best debate yet. Take a look at her at that watch party overnight after the debate right there with her husband, Bill Clinton. She was all smiles after that watch party. She came to the back of her campaign plane to talk to reporters where she said that Donald Trump's refusal to say whether he will accept the results of this election was horrifying. Take a listen to that. You know, it was horrifying what he said on the debate stage tonight. What he said tonight is part of his whole effort to blame somebody else for his campaign and for where he stands in this election. So that's her reaction this morning. Her team is also talking about Donald Trump's behavior on that stage. Let me just tell you a few of the words that they are using to describe it. Erratic. Uh, bizarre. They say, quote, a chilling preview of what his administration would be like. For them, this fits into the narrative that Donald Trump is not fit to be president. One other moment to talk about Trump's bad hombres line, still raising a lot of eyebrows, especially with Latinos who found that completely offensive. Clinton's camp now turning this into an attack. Amy, they say this could cause him to lose some votes in heavily Latino states like Arizona, where they are already trying to make some, some inroads. Amy. All right, Cecilia Vega, thanks for that.